There's a bear in there And a chair as well There are people with games And stories to tell Open wide Come inside It's play school Hmm. Hello. Hello. We're looking at the pets in play school today. <laughs> Over here are our budgerigars, Pepino and Pepina. Is that you? Yeah, that, oh. that was me. <laughs> I thought that was them. <laughs> Pepina has got yellow and black feathers on her head and her wings and green feathers on her tummy. And Pepino is covered with blue and black feathers, with a little bit of white round his face. Do Pepino and Pepina wear clothes like us? Uh-uh. <laughs> no. Birds have feathers. Tiny, soft feathers on their heads to keep them warm. That's right. And strong feathers on their wings to help them fly. What about our mice? Henry and Henrietta, do they have feathers? Uh-uh. Mice don't fly, although I think Henrietta is just <laughs> attempting it right now. Mice have fur, soft white fur all over their bodies, right down to their tails. They don't have fur on their tails, and they don't have fur on their little pink Ears. And what about Bit and Bot, our goldfish swimming in the water? Are their bodies covered with feathers or fur? Uh -uh. Fish have scales, shiny scales that make their bodies look very, very shiny. But they don't have scales on their tails and they don't have them on their fins. Can you see their fins? They've got one on their back and one underneath their bodies, one on top and one on the bottom to help them to swim. Birds with feathers, mice with fur and fish with fins. Feathers, fur or fins Feathers, fur or fins If it walks on legs or flies on wings If it runs or crawls or slithers or swims It's got its place in the scheme of things Feathers, fur or fins Feathers, fur or boom, 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 boom Fins! There's an animation of that song. Let's have a look. Feathers, fur or fins, shell or scale or skin. If it runs on legs or flies on wings, if it walks or crawls or slithers or swims, it's got its place in the scheme of things. Feathers, fur or fins. Shell or scale or skin. Well, there are some more feathery, furry animals in this picture. But they're all hiding. <laughs> you can just see some. Can you see something hiding in this bush? It's got long, long legs with Three big toes on each foot. Hmm. Can you guess what it is? Let's have a look. It's an emu. Long, long neck to go with its long legs and lots of brown and grey feathers all over its body. Now, let's see if you can guess what this is. Something sitting high up in the gum tree with a long, curly, 
furry tail. Who do you think belongs to this tail? Can you guess? It's a possum. A cheeky possum high up in the gum tree. Now there's someone or something that makes a lot of noise high up in the gum tree with a very long, strong beak and some feathers on its head. Let's see what it is. Ha ha, a kookaburra. Can you make a sound like a kookaburra laughing? Trees. We can do some more laughing. there to hold it in my face when I put it on. Now for some emu feathers. I've been cutting up this newspaper here with some emu feathers. Just a few more to go. Strips of paper. Do you need a hand, George? Thank you, Nani. If you could just finish that end off, please. Thank With you. the scissors? Yes. Please. All right. I'll cut some strips too. Long, thin paper strips. How not, far up? Well, not quite to the top because... Uh, and it'll fall apart, I think. Oh, all right. Okay. There. Finished. I finished. <laughs> How about that? Flappy ah. emu feathers. And a pointy emu beak. Oh, all right. Well, I'll help you stick them on if you like. Oh, great. Up here? Yes. You go Here. around. Okay. Excuse me, big tit. Now, no. put them on your back. I'll bend over like this. Bend over. Right up there. Do you feel like an emu? Oh, I feel a bit like an emu. <laughs> Not feeling more like an emu now. Oh, fluff I your feathers up. Fluff my feathers. Flap, flap, flap. Now. Beautiful. Let's, let's go for a long legged emu walk. Come on. You make your hand like an emu, like this? Woohoo! You're going for a wobbly walk, too? Come on. <laughs> <laughs> wobbly walk. Funny kind of walk when you wobble your knees. And you wobble, wobble, wobble. As long as you please. And you walk and you wobble. And you wobble, wobble, wobble. You do the wobbly walk. One foot down, wobble your knees. Other foot down, wobble your knees. Hands on your hips. Wobble your knees, oh, and you wobble, 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 as long as you please. And you walk, and you wobble, and you wobble, wobble, wobble. You do the wobbling walk. Oh. Emu, doing the wobbly walk. <laughs> oh. Well, there's an emu in our story today. And we've got a visitor called Sophia, who's going to tell it for us. But before the story, let's look at the clock. What time is it? The long hand is pointing straight up, so it's something o'clock. And the short hand is pointing to the one, so it's one o'clock on the flower clock. Let's see what's underneath. A lizard. 
lizard. Some more animals there. What's coming up now? Can you see that? Oh, a kookaburra. And a wombat. Hello, I'm Sophia. And I'm going to tell you a story about a chick called Chester. And here's how it goes. Chester was a new chick. He looked about him. What am I, he wondered. A butterfly floated by. Oh, said Chester, how pretty. Can I float like you? No, said the butterfly. Your wings are too short. Chester didn't really have any wings. He just had lots of soft feathers. Chester kept looking. A wombat bumped along. Oh, said Chester, can I bump along like you? No, said the wombat, your bottom is too small. So Chester kept looking. A lizard crawled by. Blash, blash, went his long tongue as he caught a juicy insect. Oh, said Chester, can I blash my tongue like you? No, said the lizard, your tongue is too slow. Chester kept looking. A kookaburra flew by. <laughs> sang the kookaburra. Oh, said Chester, can I sing like you? No, said the kookaburra, your voice is too weak. Nothing of Chester's was right. Just then his mother came home. Oh, she said, whatever is the matter? Nothing of mine is right, whispered Chester. My wings are too short. My bottom is too small. My tongue is too slow. And my voice is too weak. His mother smiled and said, Chester, try your long legs. You can stamp on them, you can spring on them, and you can run very fast on them. Oh, he said, this feels just right. I think I know what I am. I'm an emu. And he was. And that's the end of the story of Chester the baby emu. Thanks, Sophia. Can you make your hand look around like a baby emu? Oh. Up high. And down low. And run very, very fast on your long emu legs. talks. I can't hear her properly. My ears don't really work. I'm deaf. But I can talk. And I can talk in another special way with my hand. Like this. This is Chester, the baby emu. A butterfly? Hmm. Can you make your hands say butterfly? This is another animal. Can you guess what this is? Ah, the wombat bumping along with a fat bottom. We're going to tell the story of Chester the Chick again. And Sophia's going to tell it with her hands. And I'm going to say the words. Ready? Ready? Chester was a new chick. But he didn't know 
what he was. Chester wasn't a butterfly. His wings were too short. And he wasn't a wombat. His bottom was too small. Chester, can you make your hand like a wombat with a fat bottom? Bump along. Dum, 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 dum. Bump, 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 bump. Chester wasn't a lizard. His tongue was too short and too slow. Chester wasn't a kookaburra. His voice was too weak. Kookaburras have very loud voices, don't they? Chester didn't know what he was. Nothing of mine is right. When Chester's mother came home, she said, Chester, what's the matter? Try your long legs. You can stamp with them. You can bounce with them. You can run very, very fast with them. Can you run with your hands? Chester said, this feels just right. I think I know what I am. Chester Chick was an emu. And that's the end of the story. <laughs> Chester Chick had long legs to stamp on. Come on, let's stamp. 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 What else can we do on our long legs? How about jumping? Jumping with our long legs. Here we go. Jump. Whoa. Big jumps. And jump. Whoa. More big jumps. Here we go. Jump. Oh, one more. Jump. Woo. And how about some running? Like Chester Chick. Running on the spot. Fast running. Here we go. Fast. about bending our long legs at the knees. Here we go, bending right down, bending down. Whoop. Can you get right down? I can just add up again. Whoop. Another big bend on our long legs. Bending. Keep your balance. And up. One more. Here we go. some long legs on our calendar. What day is it on our bippity body calendar? What day is it today? Today is... Wednesday. And every day this week we'll be seeing some wooden bodies with long wooden legs in an animation.
Well, there's something else we can do with our bodies. Sophia's not using any words. She's talking with her body. What do you think she's doing? Picking flowers. Hmm. Ready for some more body talk? All right, let's see if we can guess what Sophia is doing. She's sleeping. Oh, waking up with a big stretch. Getting out of bed. Walking. Where's she going? Turning on taps. Washing her face. Do you do that in the morning? Drying it. Squeezing some toothpaste to brush her teeth. Have you got a toothbrush to brush your teeth too? Hmm. I brush my teeth in the morning. I brush my teeth in the morning. I brush my Another one? You ready? She's taken something out of a bag. Opening the door, closing it. Putting on a seatbelt. She's going to drive in a car. Turning it on. It's going. Should we have a drive too? Come on. Seatbelt's on. That's it. Take you driving in my car, car. Take you driving in my car, car. I'll take you driving in my car, car. I'll take you driving in my car. All right, let's stop. Seat belts off. All right. One more. Another one. Let's look. Walking. Walking along. Looking up, a long way, what is it? Opening a door, oh she's going up some stairs, she must be in a building, right up to the top, looking over, it's a long way up, she doesn't like it so she's going downstairs now, <laughs> do you want to come upstairs? Let's go up, we're going up, we're going going to look through the windows now and see some children climbing up and down. Come on. Which window shall we look through today? The square one, I think. Up some steps. Nice, safe, soft steps. Climbing up to a balancing beam. Take it slowly, get your balance. Need a grown up to be nearby when you're on a balancing beam, don't you? That's it. Easy does it. Oh, there's a lovely swing. Whee! Swinging with her hands. That'll make her arms strong. Forwards and backwards. Whee! Oh, what's happening to her? Ah, oh, she's going to have a swing sitting down this time. Little push. Do you sometimes have a ride on a swing? She wants to hang on with her hands again, I think. There's a big trampoline. Bounce, bounce. 
They're in a gym, a play gym. Lots of different things to try. Ah, what's happening here? There's a tunnel, a red tunnel. Oh, oh, learning how to do somersaults. He wants him to go in the tunnel. That's it. Very good somersault. Hands in front. Tuck your head in, tuck it in. <laughs> there he goes. Oh, he's going through the tunnel. Where is he, where is he, where is he? There he is. There's a slippery dip there too. Bounce. Looks like lots of fun. Oh, holding on tight and lifting your feet up to the bar. Through the hole, oh, you bring your feet through the hole. He's an acrobat. Oh, you're going to go over the bar, eh? All right. Up and over. Goodness Fixed me. Big strong arms on top. Oh, oh. Very good. Big smile. <laughs> All right, I'm back over again. Oh, OK, I'm back down again. Oh, very good. Hang on tight. And a big jump down. Big jump, da -da What a lot of fun. Hmm. Something for the toys to slide down. And here's your trampoline, Big Ted. You ready? Come on and bounce, bounce, bounce. Come on and bounce, bounce, bounce. Come on and try it. Let's all bounce, bounce, bounce. Bit more bouncing. Bit higher. Higher bouncing. Okay, here we go. Standing up. Come on and bounce, bounce, bounce. Come on and bounce, bounce, bounce. Come on and try it. Let's all bounce, bounce, bounce. Whoa. That was good, wasn't it? Yes. Oh, someone else's turn. <laughs> How about a slippery slide oh, for yes. banana? Come on and slide, 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 come on and slide, 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 come on and try it, let's all slide, 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 that's banana, is he a bit giddy, oh he's humpty, might like to Roll. Oh, rolling. Okay. Give it a try. Yes, I think you'll like to. Come ha. on and roll. 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 Come on and roll. 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 Come on and try it. Let's all roll. Roll. Come One more. On. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> roll. Safely onto the cushion. <laughs> Now, who can we put on the balancing beam? Oh, oh, here comes Sophia with Jemima. Oh, Jemima. In her lovely new gym tights. Ah, Very yes. nice. Here she goes. Come on, Jemima. Balancing. Over to me. Oh, oh, you can do it. You balance that. That's it. Yes, hooray for Jemima. Yay. She made it. Well, you might like to make a play gym for your toys. Yes, but it's time for us to go now. Mm. Goodbye. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> Where's Humpty? Let's he wants one more guide. Here we go. Send him down. Hey! Oh! oh. <laughs>